Download this code and get free GPT-40 from CodeGive.com, link in the description below. Sure. Here's a tutorial about Python programming focusing on void functions, function calls, and the return statement. In Python, functions are used to encapsulate reusable pieces of code. Functions can perform specific tasks and may or may not return a value. Void functions are functions that do not return any value. They are used when you want a function to perform a task without needing to return any result. Let's start with an example of a simple void function. In this example, the greet function takes a name parameter and prints a greeting message to the console. Since the function does not return any value, it is considered a void function. To call the greet function and pass a name as an argument, you can do the following. When you run this code, it will output, Hello, Alice. Now, let's look at how the return statement works in Python functions. The return statement is used to exit a function and optionally return a value. It can be used in both void and non-void functions. Here's an example of a function that calculates the square of a number and returns the result. You can call the square function and store the returned value in a variable like this. In this example, the square function returns the square of the input number, which is then stored in the result variable and printed to the console. To summarize, void functions are functions that do not return any value. The return statement is used to exit a function and return a value. Void functions are useful for performing tasks without needing to return a result, while functions with a return statement can calculate values and pass them back to the calling code. I hope this tutorial helps you understand void functions, function calls, and the return statement in Python programming. Let me know if you have any questions or need further clarification.